human-sized birdhouses that different oh, artists goodness, yes. were commissioned to do. And it was like walking into, um, you know, your Alice in Wonderland, and you, mm -hmm. eat, if she eats and gets smaller, drinks and gets smaller. I can never figure out what she does, but she does one of those things, and she gets shrunk down, and all of a sudden, the bumblebees bigger. and the yeah. ladybugs are big and bold and beautiful. Now, you may look at this in our video and wonder, how big are they? Well... From Plow and Hearth, this is my pick of the show, Nancy Brand Muller, who will always have a very dear space in my heart, because when I came back to QVC after a year off, you were my first guest. I know. I, I always, always think about always, that, too. Always, always Me, honored too. You. And you. she's a big shoe shopper. Thanks. Yeah. Shout out to my shoe shopping girls <laughs> who are watching tonight. Look okay. at these. Chubbly wubbly Look. and adorable. And you do feel like you have shrunk down you do. and you're sort of in this magical land. Oh my gosh. Where all the little bugs and critters are bigger. Wow. So here's the thing. We usually do Tuesday Vibes with Jane and Sean. Sean's on vacation. We'll both be back together again next week. So if you're tuning in for shoe shopping, get ready for Garden Whimsy. But this is a set of two from Plow and Hearth. Look at the size of the mama and the baby. Imagine this for a Mother's Day present. And I don't know if Sean Killinger is watching QVC because I think she's on vacation. But Sean, if anybody she knows Sean, have those. just buy it for her. She needs it. Hello. $49.98 for the Ladybug, by far the more limited, or the Sweet Bumblebee. We'll always honor our Joan, who said it was the symbol mm -hmm. of the impossible. Oh, my gosh, Nancy. All right, let's start off. I'm so excited. Deep breath. Breathe. Deep breath. Okay. It's not shoes, Jane. Breathe. Uh, Plow and Hearth, a yes. name that I've trusted even long before you guys came to QVC. And me, too. Mm -hmm. I was a customer for many, many yeah. years and thrilled to have the opportunity to share that with the, view and the QVC viewers because Plow and Hearth is a company out of Madison. Madison, Virginia. They bring you those kind of items that they create to help your garden and your home have that warmth and welcome. Also to give it that special touch, kind of that magic, like they've sprinkled fairy dust on your garden yeah. and you have something so unique and special because I truly believe that gardening is a competitive sport <laughs> and decorating for your garden. Let's do that too yes. because I love to decorate and add special pieces that are unique and different that my friends say, Nancy, where'd you get where'd that? Where'd you That's get that? So different. Okay, so I concede and I fold. You know me. I've said it to you. I am not the best gardener when it comes to plants, but man, do I decorate. Decorate. I love to decorate. decorate. So let's talk about sure. these dimensions. And this even seems smaller than it actually, I mean, the, the dimension when I lead them, right. it's like 14 by 12 by 10. It seems bigger than it that. It really does. It's so gorgeous and a, a bright splash of color in your garden, even before the flowers start blooming. Yes, I And love you that. get both. The baby is about seven by six by five, but they both seem bigger. They really do. They really do. If yeah. you want the ladybugs, shout out to Sean Killinger. I hope somebody is buying them for her. Look at the size and look at that face. We only have 1,200 left. And the ladybug is such a beautiful symbol of luck. It is. And then our, our darling little bees. I'm partial to bees because I'm Nancy B for QVC. So I always love bees. I love that they're pollinators. You want them in your garden. You want these little guys. Look at that face. Now these are made out of cement. I do want you to know they're beautifully done out of cement. There's this lovely high sheen enamel on the outside here, but also Plow and Hearth left that artistic touch of leaving some of this unfinished. So it gives you That's some cool. different texture and you're seeing a beautiful shot of the painting which is kind of like a, a watercolor so you see that differentiation in the colors there a little bit That's lighter Latif. a little darker he's that, working it so beautiful and you then, know what yes did you know the price is going up at the end of the day oh my goodness yeah so the price is going up at the end of the day so they'll be 61 dollars and worth every penny we have a beautiful garden center around the corner from yes. us when i walk in there i'm just like here take my credit card just take it right now which is why i never go in there because hello i work at qvc these guys i don't even know where they would be price wise right. but even our low price gets even better right now look at them in the garden instead of 61 dollars at midnight tonight west coast and mm -hmm. they're only under 50 they're on five Obviously, payments of $9.99, and if they do again sell out, I don't have an advance order, and I also know the price is going up at the end of the day, and we only have 1,100 ladybugs left. Oh, my goodness. Well, you know, these are so charming. I love that they're oversized. I love that they have vibrant colors. Look at them tucked into your flowers and your plants. They're going to add such personality, and they're something that you can put out right now. Right. Unless you have 12 feet of snow on the ground, you don't want these covered in snow. You want to enjoy 
enjoy them. So if you get them home and you have really bad weather outside, bring them inside. Start enjoying them. I but think they would be adorable in the house. I really would. Absolutely. And you know, Joan, this is very much tied to our beloved Joan, who we love so much. Joan Rivers told us the legend of the ladybug, that it was in France and there were, there were these terrible bugs that were eating all the crops. And so the people went to the cathedral and they prayed to Our Lady. And lo and behold, the next morning, these red and black bugs came oh and goodness. ate all the bad bugs. And so that's where they got their story. name of Ladybug for Our Lady because that little miracle oh happened. Gosh, I love Isn't that. Isn't that sweet? I so they've really always been a symbol of good luck. Mm -hmm. They've always been happy and joyous. And then the bumblebee, again, should not fly. It's a symbol of the impossible. It gets up off the ground and it does it. So I don't know, you could not bring more positivity to our show tonight. Yeah, it's and I love really you for great. it, Nance. Oh, well, these are so cute. Tucked into your garden. You know, you could put these by your front porch. How about when people are walking up to your door, greeted by this darling little chubby bumblebee oh, so and the little cute. baby, or maybe that ladybug for good luck. So right. when people are or walking both. up, it, I love them both cute. together. Yeah, you know, I really love cute. like this, like the accent of the deep black against the bright primary. So we've had 900 for the day, 400 in the show. The price is going up at the end of the day. Only a thousand people can get the ladybugs. Okay. Oh my gosh. But Nancy has more cuteness tucked up this sleeve of hers. <laughs> right Coming here. up in patio and garden where everything is on five easy payments and Nancy outdid yourself. These are adorable. Thank you so much. So in about 10 minutes, we're also going to have for you, okay, come on, my cardinal blessing.